Well, bad news, it's pretty much as bad as it can get. Um, I'm knee deep right now in pulling the head off. Um, one of the valves has seized up for whatever reason, probably because of an overheating. And I'm gonna guess that happened because of a bad uh, thermostat. One eternity later. And it is a valve that stuck open. Um, a couple things could be causing that, but all of them require pretty much ripping the head out. Really close to it now. I think it's like four hours into this ordeal. The van's gonna be back on the road, baby. One way or another. I would have filmed more of this. Not that this is a kid's show, but uh, yeah, there would have been a lot of expletives. I'll give you a quick look around at what's come out and uh, I'm gonna get back to it. You can see down in there, the valve on the left is sticking out. Valve on the right is not. That little silver thing. But yeah, all of the other ones you can see, both of them for each cylinder are the same. But all of a sudden here, yeah, one of these kids is doing their own thing. So it's now a matter of ripping out the rest of that head. I think I'm 10 bolts away from that. But I don't know. You never know till you get there. So the verdict is clear, the head is off, it is a valve stuck open, so it's going to need to go to the head shop. It should be a relatively simple enough fix. I don't know, we won't until we get there. It's definitely something that's done often, so it's not something that never ever ever happens. Now it's just a matter of getting us to the head shop to uh, have an expert weigh in on what should be done next.